So a lot of times in my line of work, I have run into many individuals who have feelings of guilt or shame when having to end a relationship or cut someone off. Nowadays, society tells you that, you know, if you cut someone off and you end communication with someone um, that you love and care about, that that is a cowardly way of approaching things or that you're not mature or however, and that's not always the case. A lot of times the person that's doing the cutting off has exhausted all other possibilities, all other options. They've gone with setting boundaries. They've tried the communicating. And a very last resort to protect themselves, they are choosing to end the relationship. So something that we're not considering is that when a person who genuinely loves and cares for an individual chooses to end the relationship or cut communication off, they are also choosing to go through the grieving process. Think about that. Choosing grief is not a cowardly thing. It's actually the opposite. It's very courageous because it's easy for us to bend to the will of others instead of asserting our own. Also choosing others and people pleasing instead of loving ourselves and pleasing ourselves. So choosing yourself and loving yourself and self-love truly does not always feel good. And in this world and in society today, it is telling us that self-love is bubble baths and lingerie and taking yourself out on solo dates and all that good stuff. And no, self-love really is making those tough decisions that don't always feel good. And that also might look like cutting somebody you love off.